Hey everyone, um, you're not going to believe it, but we're in Texas and it's cold. <laughs> Actually going to do another unboxing. Um, I wanted to show you guys this gun. Uh, if you guys followed me last year, if you guys followed me last year, I came down to Texas and did a little pig hunting with the guys from the Element. Well, Tyler, my buddy Tyler from the Element, the Element Podcast, yeah, he had a little bit of trouble with his gun, so I thought, you know what, I need to remedy that. So, uh, I want to do a little unboxing. Got another CZ here for you. Let me crack into it. This is the CZ 1012 in all terrain, which is going to be a great gun for pig hunting and a great gun for these conditions if I can make my fingers work. Let me show you the, uh, the up close and personal here. Of course, got the standard CZ case, got our coke tubes here, and we got our blue velvet bags. I'll get these off here and we can take a closer look at this shotgun. So, so you guys know me, hey, uh, auto loaders aren't really my cup of tea in most scenarios but for pig hunting in Texas an auto loader might just be the thing hey what that bag is tight tight on there took me a hot second to get our uh, blue velvet bags off that's probably um, partly because my fingers are about frozen I think it's uh 30 degrees out uncharacteristically cold for this part of Texas uh, but let me go ahead and show you the gun in the case of course it comes with the choke tubes extended black choke tubes we'll show those here you get a total of five You can make some adjustments as well. You've got some shims for adjustments if you want to make adjustments to your stock. And you got the choke wrench here. Woo! First, we'll take the plug out of the action. So, unlike Tyler's gun last year, the CZ1012 is not a gas operated semi auto, it's inertia. And so he was having problems with his shotgun cycling last year. And uh, this should remedy all that. Inertia driven gun is going to be more consistent cycling through shells. Uh, and if we can get our hands to work, we'll get this bad boy put together. As you guys can see, this has got the uh, Cerakote, the all terrain series has the Cerakote finish in sage green uh, on the receiver and on the barrels. So this gun is going to be extremely corrosion resistant. Um, and it should be good because the condition tomorrow are supposed to be wet. Uh, and now I just have to figure out how to put together an auto loader. As you guys know, most of the time I am shooting over-unders. So it's a rare occasion when I end up shooting an auto loader. So I have to remind myself how to put these bad boys together. Okay, warm my fingers up. This gun's really tight because it's brand new, but. So it takes a little bit of arm wrestling for me to get everything put together. Whew! Ah. Oh man, my fingers are cold.
So there we go. Whew. Whew. We've got the CZ 1012 all terrain 12 gauge. I really like feels like I got a really smooth action. I can't believe how cold it is. This should fix all of Tyler's problems. You guys will get to see it in use tomorrow. And now that my fingers are good and cold, I think I'm going to go ahead and box this baby back up. So tune in tomorrow for the pig hunt. Catch the element. You'll see all this. We're going to uh, be videoing it. But that's the CZ-1012. Of course, it cycles uh, three-inch three shells. Uh, it's four plus one, four and the two plus one. Uh, your standard auto loader 12 gauge balance about six and a half pounds. CZ USA. Looking forward to getting out and uh, watching Tyler shoot this tomorrow.